Hey guys, Kwame here, and in this video, we'll show you how to send a transaction using pr a private key with the Chainsafe Gaming SDK. And as you can see here, this is the end result where we have the transaction hash of 0xe6, and we have 0xe6 inside the editor. And I'll just uh, minimize this. And once you have downloaded the new SDK and clicking on the Web3 Unity folder, and inside the prefabs, you'll see that we have a new folder called private key. And selecting that, you'll see that we have prefabs for sending ERC20s, sending an ERC721, sending an ERC1155, sending a broadcast transaction, signing a message, and getting the wallet address. For this example, we're going to drag in the send transaction prefab. And I'll just open this up and select the script. Now selecting the SIP script, we will see that we have a on send transaction um, on click method. And the properties that we need are the private key. This is for demonstration purposes only. The chain, which is going to be Ethereum. The network, which is Rinkaby. The account, which is calling the class method address from Web3 private key, passing in the private key. The address that we want to send the funds to. The value in way, which in this case is 123 an optional value for the RPC, which is blank. The chain ID, which calls the EVM class methods chain ID, passing in the chain network and RPC. The gas price, which calls EVM gas price, passing in chain network and RPC. Data, which is blank for this example. Gas limit, which is 21,000. This will change based on the chain that you're working with. The transaction, which calls EVM create transaction, passing in chain network account to value data, gas price, gas limit, and RPC. The signature, which calls web3 private key dot sign transaction, passing in private key transaction and chain ID. The response, which calls EVM broadcast transaction, passing in chain network account to value data, signature, gas price, gas limit, and RPC. We print out this response. Then we open up Rinkeby um, Etherscan and passing in the response. So with that being said, we will go into the game mode and you'll see a button for send transaction. We'll click play and then select the send transaction button. Now this brings up Etherscan with our transaction of zero X EB8 and you'll see zero X EB8 here. Okay, and now this has been completed. We see success as the status and that is how you send a transaction using the private key. See you guys in the next video. Bye for now.